My name is Bilal Saab. I'm a senior fellow and uh, director of the Middle East Peace and Security Initiative here at the Atlantic Council. This report comes at a time of increasing tension and uncertainty in the Kingdom of uh, Bahrain. The crisis between the government and the opposition has deepened, and Washington is understandably worried, uh, not only because the U.S. Uh, Fifth Fleet headquarters are present in Bahrain and uh, we have more than 8,000 Americans and their families at the base in Manama, but also because the stability of the country, which is an old and crucial partner of the United States in a strategically vital region, affects directly the free flow of global goods from the Gulf to the international economy. We also care about Bahrain because its stability affects directly Saudi Arabia, which is another major partner of the United States. But as we, the United States, have faced some tough challenges in Bahrain and our policy has struggled quite a bit, to come up with something that is more sustainable and is more effective because so far we have managed to alienate both the government and the opposition which in many ways indicates that our approach is lacking. I argue that it all starts with a more informed uh, understanding of the political and economic crisis in the country but also of the limitations of both Washington and Manama. The U.S. policy debate on Bahrain needs to be more balanced and I hope that this report provides some necessary nuance that can be useful for our posture in the country and our efforts to secure our interests there.